And now here you are at last, my dear. And my story's almost done. Don't you have a kiss for your grandmama? Isabella Borgia? <laughs> this is fucking impossible! You can't still be alive after a hundred years! Did you come to shut me down, take control, sell us out, Lucretia? I know you plan to usurp Hunter. I've been watching you, you know. How like me you are, Lucretia. A schemer, an empire builder. I am nothing like you, and I never will be. You're not even human anymore. Look at you! You're a monster! It's disgusting. I'm much more than human. I am the living brain and nervous system of Neonopolis. I hardly remember where I end and Neonopolis begins anymore. Even the heat of summer is my doing. It was important to make our city a more welcoming environment for our guest. You brought this thing! It was you! You and my father! These creatures have superior genetic material that we can use to clone and make armies. To spawn a thousand children like Hunter, genetically adapted to conquer this world and others in Mother's name. You're insane! If I shut you down, it'll leave us alone. Bruno used to say to me, it's all just jungle, baby. Behind the fancy hotels, the churches, and the diamond parlors, it's all just predators and prey. And he was right. The monster is working its way up the food chain. You take over if you like, Lucretia. It'll only hunt you down and kill you. Like it killed Bruno, the god of gangsters. No! I won't let it! <laughs> Bruno? That makes you the boss now? Are you going to kill a woman and her baby to prove it? Hunter was a sickly child. I knew it even then. He could never have survived but for the blood. The blood of the Predator. That keeps us strong and allows us to live unnaturally long lives. That was the first of the gifts it gave us. And in its desperate attempts to escape from our world, it left behind the others. <laughs>